Hello everyone. So I touched on this previously. Um, I touched on this subject previously in a video. Um, I had a call from a lady. She wanted. Um, she said her husband tried to change a light in the bathroom. He couldn't do it. Could I come and have a look? I said, yeah, that's fine. The next day he rang me and said, there's two lights to do down in the garage. I said, not a problem. I'll probably come to you tomorrow, but I'll let you know. So when I got there, lovely couple. The husband's got um, sort of Alzheimer's coming. And, um, you know, she pulled me aside and said he might say uh, things a few times to you. Um, don't worry about it. It's, it's what it is. Said, there's no problem. No problem. So when I was working there, I did the bathroom light and then I went down to the garage and then I'd finished and I was just loading up the van and the lady come and said to me, look, um, we don't normally ask um, tradesmen for help because my husband used to do everything. And I said, yeah, that, that's fair enough. Um, she goes, but he's quite old now and, he, and he's got this um, Alzheimer's coming and stuff and he's just not capable of doing stuff anymore. She said, and um, we stupidly started to put a fence panel, um, it's only a trellis, at the front of the house. Um, a week ago or whatever it was and um she said two gentlemen come over and said look you look like you're struggling would you like a hand and she said she thought about it and then thought um yeah great thank you that would be really kind of you to help us and then he said no 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 not with not with the um not with the trellis but your gutters they definitely need cleaning and um she thought about it and then thought we we've we've lived here 4 years and they haven't been cleaned for 2 years so she said okay yeah that'd be great um thank you so she said they just they came in like overalls, um, looked like they were working, and they even said to her, look, we're working two doors down, which is like a classic line um, for these sort of people. And um, she said they were like a Lauren and Hardy. They just got a ladder, dragged a, um, dragged a few bits out of the gutter. They were there 20 minutes. Um, but then they said to her, that will be £300. And um, she, couldn't, she couldn't quite believe it. She, you know, £300 for 20 minutes work. Um, for two blokes with a ladder to clean some gutters is um that's terrible really and that's um and then the and to make it worse they followed her to the cash machine in their van and um waited for her to get the money out and then said we'll drop you a receipt off later love and um she never saw him again so you've just got to be very very careful um that there are people out there to rip you off so the moral of the story is what i'm going to do now is I've come to the conclusion that I'm not actually going to charge the lady for the work that I did. I was there probably with the driving and going away, blah, 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 probably two hours. And I'm not going to charge her for that. So what I'm going to do now is ring her now. She doesn't know I'm doing this. She doesn't even know I've got a YouTube channel. So all I need you guys to do is give the video a thumbs up. Give me a little comment down below. And just that shows me that you appreciate the video. And then hopefully we can make the money back in other ways. Yeah. So I'm going to call her now. I will blank her name out and any information that is spoke about now. But this is 100% a genuine phone call. Hello, Chris. Is everything okay? Hi, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Good, Have good. Have you sent anything to Cliffy and he hasn't sent you anything back? No, no, no. All I'm ringing to tell you is that... um. I'm not actually going to charge you, Sandra, because I feel so bad for what those other people have done to you. I just want to let you know that there are still some decent people out there. So I just for this one, oh, for this one, I'm not, I'm not going to charge you for the for the work that I did. Okay. Oh, I feel like I could cry. Thank you so much. <laughs> That's oh. all right. Oh goodness, thank you. That's okay. I just thought I'd let you know, and I, you know, because you're probably expecting an invoice, and I'm not going to send one. Oh, so. Gosh. Yeah, I, I thought when you phoned, I thought, oh, God, um, hasn't sent it, I thought. But at least you've remembered to tell me, so that was good. Yeah, yeah. But, um, oh, Chris, thank you. That's all right. Thank you very much. I can't tell you how nice that is to hear at the moment. <laughs> That's all right. Oh, no worries. Lovely. All right. Oh, Chris, we'll see you sometime in the future, yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, definitely. Okay. All right. Thank, Cheers, so then. Much, Take care. Thank you. All right, then. Bye-bye. Bye. There we go, guys. 100% genuine phone call with a customer. As you can tell, she's absolutely over the mood. And for me, that's just... For those arseholes to do that to her, I just feel like I can repay her just by doing that for her, um, doing that little bit of work and not actually charging her, yeah? So please give the video a thumbs up and um, I'll see you on the next one.